We're extremely proud to, be, to have become approved OCAFEN installers. It's been a process we've been working towards over the last two years and now we are able to install and commission our own boilers. We still have the technical backup of OCAFEN and they still guarantee pellet supply. So if at any point through the lifetime of this boiler being in the field, we have a problem with pellet supply in the UK, OCAFEN will support their customers by bringing uh, good quality pellets over from Europe uh, to ensure that uh, we never run out with any of the installations that we have. The um, OCAFEN system that you're seeing here is a automatic pellet feed system. Uh, you can have these where they um, either are manual feed where you fill them with bags, feeding uh, with an auger fed system from a hopper nearby, or if you need to have your pellet store uh, up to 20 meters away, you can then have these systems vacuum feed the pellets in. This is uh, an automatic ash uh, box. So the system will clean itself periodically and it just puts the ash into here and probably once a year, or if it's uh, been a very cold year, you might need to just simply uh, lift this off and uh, put that into the, the garden somewhere and then put it back onto the boiler. With the um, Okafen system, uh, we can open the, the bottom door and under here we can see the uh, auto cleaning mechanism where we've got the auger that's taking the ash into the automatic de-ashing assembly here. You have the burner plate and you can see where the air is being introduced uh, there. With the Okafen, um, it's important when the system's running not to leave the door open for more than a minute, otherwise it will shut the boiler down waiting for you to close the door. This is a, a cutaway system that we use for our office demonstrations. Um, the Okafen has a, a self-cleaning uh, mechanism down here which will save you needing to uh, get in and clean the boiler on a weekly basis. It has um, high levels of insulation in the chassis uh, which will keep um, the temperature of the boiler warm for up to 24 hours um, after its last burn. You have a specialist um, plate here which takes the pellets fed through from underneath. This improves the efficiency of the boiler because it doesn't disturb the firebase as the pellets are being fed through. This is the area where the combustion takes place, where the air is introduced to the pellets and can get as high as a thousand degrees C in here. And then the flue gases are worked through a process, a tertiary system, which takes the heat away from those, transferring that through to heating and hot water, and it leaves the boiler through the flue system at around about 100 to 200 degrees C.